Hello everybody and welcome back to Last One Out. As always, I am your host James and today, today we bring you Emure. Now, a couple months ago, I actually did play a demo, and I don't know if this is the same exact demo, uh, to this game at Too Many Games um, in Pennsylvania. And God, I couldn't wait for the demo, and I really can't wait for the full release. Uh, as you can see in the title there, October 15th, uh, probably be after the time this recording goes up. Not 100% certain. But I'm hoping that uh, this goes up before and you guys can support them on Kickstarter. This place. I know she wanted me to find this place, but why? I played this game, the demo, um, at uh, Too Many Games, and it was one of the best game demos I had ever experienced, and that sounds like a weird sentence, but I had an absolute blast. There's nothing back the way I came, and I can't leave before I get my answers. A drawer with an odd design on it. it looks like it can be opened. Or I can open it. Door knob seems to be missing. I should look around before trying to break the door down. And there's the doorknob. Now, like I said, I played this demo at uh, Too Many Games a couple months back, and first off, everything about this game is right up my alley. The art style, the soundtrack, and the element in which we'll see as to... What I mean by that? Keep hitting E to open doors. What is this on the wall? Some kind of painted door? Everything I've seen about this game... Who put this here? And why? Ugh. What was that? The paint almost looks fresh. I'll tell you now, if this game had voice work, I don't know if it does at the time. Uh, you know, if you guys need a voice actor for uh, the main character here, I'll do it. Hello, floating rock. It's been a while. Well, I can offer you power. Oh, that's, that hurts to do that voice. And that voice. And this is what I saw in my dream. The Shining Trapezodron. <laughs> I'm not gonna... Ooh, that would take a couple tries. The Shining Rock. And this is what... One of the things that sold me is this scene right here. In like, I need more of this game. That transition... My head. Where am I? I can barely see anything. Press left button, generate pulse, which can reveal me of our secrets. Where am I now? See, when a game tells you to sprint, you're not gonna like to. Everything keeps changing. Space to hide. Ooh. It didn't seem to work. And the rule of the horror game is if the... Oh. Ooh. What the hell makes that a sound like that? That big home bitch. And into the coffin we go. Wait a minute. Nope, this is playing just like the demo. Okay. Oh 
Oh! Oh my god! Yeah, I didn't fuck up in the demo when I was playing it, but uh, I fucked up here. <gasps> oh, god damn it! Ah, ah. Okay. It wouldn't be a game without me dying at least once or twice, especially in my own stupidity. Oops. Yes, that's how you do it. Pick up the strange key. Whoop. God, that monster design is absolutely terrifying. And I love it. Oh! Wait, this way, this way. Key, key, go this way. Whew. The darkness stares back. What do I have left to live for? Don't trust your memories. Reality is a lie. I long for the sweet release of death. You reveal its will. The energy that pulsates from this wall. Bathe me in its power. That voice again. It feels almost painful to hear it. Now, the power is capable of more than you realize, but you must learn to harness it. Looks like a strange blade from some kind, but I can't reach it between the bars. If I remember correctly, let check. Can't remember. Whoops. Yeah, I gotta hold it, that's right. Okay. <laughs> it's tangled up so it can't come after me. Oh, yeah, that's right. Pick up the unearthly dagger. Where are you, you son of a bitch? Come on. Hey. another shape thingy that would look great on my desk. They would look great on my desk, in all honesty. I mean, probably with the red trapezoid jotted on, and the yellow thing, and if there's a green one... Huh! Huh! Ah! What? It's just a dream, huh? Even in my sleep, I can't escape this place. Ugh. How did the chandelier fall? Shame, really. Hmm. 
This metallic shard just showed up when I awoke from that nightmare. It has a dark obsidian colored base or top depending on how I hold it. Ugh. Why is it not? There we go. Large metal door with some rust around the edges. It looks really out of place in, well, wherever I am. There's no mansion. What, what kind of door is this? The air around it smells horrible. It, it looks like it's if it's been put together by some type of leather. Leather, oh, leather, it's flesh. Fleshy bits. I feel so tired. I just want to get out of this place. So Basil has insets on top. I wonder if it's connected to that massive platform. Well, yeah, better put the rock thing there. Nope. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, you know. oh. Uh, oh, okay. Shiny static. Oh, oh god. I think I did a note. What? The scream. That was. This has to be it. it looks like there are more slots to fill. Seems like a plain wooden door. The smell of pine floats around it. Locked. Trust? Uh, what? Who are you? Come now, Will. You know the rules. I... Do I know you? Uh, of course you know me, my fine friend. And I can tell you more about your situation, but first you must do something for me. How about you just tell me what is going on here? The room is my home, and in my home you follow my rules. When talking to me, you must be seated in the chair in front of me. Treat it like a game if it helps you to understand. So please, sit. Alright, but you better answer my questions afterwards. Oh, this chair is so comfy. So, look at that beauty. Who are you and how do you know me? I am he who sees through which has not been seen through my so many. I am a lover of stories and fine art of wordsmithery. I am your friend and only true friend in this awful predicament you find yourself in. Okay, I feel like you are messing with me and I'm not really in the mood. Just tell me what you know. Fine, fine. You can just call me the sa uh, uh, safe room guy. Yeah, call me that. Well, I can offer you help, but you will have to find most answers yourself. I'm going to give you a key that goes to a door in the mansion. You need to go through that door where you will find a soul trapped inside. You must either destroy the soul or free it. Save or destroy a soul? This really is just a game to you, isn't it? Ha! <laughs> well, an eternity of reading does get rather dull. Regardless of how you feel about what I say, you have no other choice. <laughs> this is ridiculous, but I'll humor you, safe room guy. 
So say you are telling me the truth. How do I free or destroy a soul? To save, you must seek out something important to that soul that reminds them of their humanity. To destroy, you must force them to repeat their death. Repeat their death? Are you asking me to be a murderer? Each soul committed atrocities before they died, so maybe feeling sorry for them is optional? Regardless, you will need to do some investigation to figure out how to do either. No need to fret about that part. We both know that investigation comes naturally to you. But, but why is it that I have to do any of this? Because you said so? Your question will be answered in time, probably. So here, take the key so I can get back to whatever it is I do. Fine, give me the damn key. Hopefully I'll wake up soon so this can all be over with. Don't treat this like a dream, Willie. If you do, it may be the last one you ever have. That was not a threat. Just a warning. The door that unlocks... The door that this key unlocks is white and down some stairs, I think. Anywho, if you need help, you can always come back and see me again. So there's no save just yet. And there's not really much else he tells me, um, to my memory. But we're going to keep going, uh, for the sake of the video. Enter East Hallway. Oh. Just looped around. Oh. It's... Looks like the kind of door you would see for a child's room. Does a child live here? Seems to be locked. It's strange. Are the subjects in these being arbitrary? Or is there something related to them all? Just a bookcase. Although it is embedded in the wall for some reason. It's a door. Five bucks is a door. Right, downstairs to a white door. It looks like a door that leads to the ground level hall. Locked. How odd. Through time and space, he said. What kind of door is this? It looks like something from out of an 80s sci fi movie. A handgun. It's strange that somebody would leave it here like this. This, like, yeah, can't talk. It looks like that's somebody else that left a note. Note from Johnny Sir Will, I took the liberty of retrieving your handgun for you. As you know, it won't be able to eradicate the most capable of wraiths, but several doses of lead should put them down for a time. If you find yourself under assault with only a bullet to spare, a well-timed shot, as they are striking, should provide a moment of reprieve. Also, my dear Will, if you want to keep your head affixed to your neck, then you must learn to keep quiet and stick to the darkness. You may find the darkness arduous, but it is only necessary to put out your light sources when they are within eyesight. Sound, however, has a way of penetrating doors and thin walls. So you must always be attentive of how much noise you are making. Of course, these places will be visiting you. You will be visiting have a tendency to break the natural laws that govern the world of man. Just keep your wits about you, and you should be fine. I have a few errands to take care of, but rest assured, I will be seeing you later. Sincerely, Johnny. This handgun is mine. How is that possible? I can't use this. What is yours is pathetic. It is a destructive tool. Take it. Stumners will only get me killed. I'll take it despite a damn antagonizing crystal telling me to... I haven't held on quite some time. I should re-familiarize myself with it. No ammo. Figures. Looks like the kind of door you see at a school or in a stairwell.
so used I haven't hit that button. Ah! <clears throat> oh, that's an old Resident Evil feeling right there. And I never, truth is, I never actually played a single Resident Evil game past a little bit of Resident Evil 4. But, oh. Some kind of lobby? This was not in the demo that I played. Jenny by the sign on the door, I'd say that it might be a janitor's closet. Can't get in. Looks pretty comfy, but where is everyone? Quite a rustic fireplace. Why do we have our cabin by the lake? Oh! What the? Do you feel how dense the air is <laughs> in here, Will? When the spots are revealed through my power, you will see what once was. Oh! 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 I had to. <laughs> Apartments. Okay, I could not. Is this the way out? What is this thing on the door? Oh, yeah, it's going to let me leave. Oh, yeah. The vent is barely open yet. There's smoke seeping out of it. Can't go that way. I didn't do that. Footsteps. Seems like I'm not alone in here. You are pretty. That's not good when there's a this place reeks. I hope this isn't what I think it is. Oh. Sure, I'll take some batteries. Huh. No. <gasps> oh, hi. I see you, you're on fire. Uh, hello? Hello there, mister. I see you found one of my drawings. My name is Anne Marie. Who are you? My name is Will, and I'm looking for a way to leave this building. Do you know how? That is a strange question. Isn't that what the front door is for? Well, yeah, <laughs> but there is uh, some type of lock over the door. A lock? Um, well, don't all the doors have locks? You do know you can unlock doors from the inside, right? I... never mind. Are there others who might be able to help me? Hmm, well, there is Brennan, but I don't think he likes me anymore. Oh, there are a few friends down below I have gathered for my tea party. You're a strange person, but my friends like strange people. So you should join us. Um... Th thanks for the invite, but I don't have time to play. Maybe I'll go talk to this Brennan. Okay, well, I'm looking for a certain somebody who is always late to tea parties. If you find him, be sure to bring it to me, okay? If you do, I might be able to help you get out of here. I don't... Maybe I will. We'll see. Thanks, mister. Bye. You're more terrifying with the lights off. Can I, um... I'm gonna go in the bedroom. Thank you. I'm so tired.
Oh! Oh! Oh, God. Am I more than just skin? Body appears to be mutilated beyond recognition. Somebody must have kept smashing this man long after he died. Yeah, time to get the fuck out of here. I'm getting creeped out. Doesn't seem to want to open. Smoke coming from under there, so I ain't gonna do that. An elevators don't work in a fire. Maybe there are safe spots, so I'm actually gonna. What up? Ah, damn it! I thought I removed that option. That isn't available right now, but it isn't like you need it at the moment. What do you mean? What is it supposed to do? The actual process of how it works is much too complex for your monkey brain. To put it simply, I forgot his voice that quick, it creates a dimensional bubble that is replicated from the current state of the universe. The bubble remains in an unchanging state and you can shift your consciousness into it at will. However, doing it destroys the current universe. Wait. So it's kind of like going back in time? Mm, I guess you could say that it does, if it helps you to understand. But you can't use it now because I haven't set it up yet, so leave that button alone! So remind me, how do I get out of here again? Well, you need to figure out how which soul is tied to the place. From that point, you can decide whether or not to destroy the soul or save it. To save it, you must find something important to the soul that reminds them of their humanity. Oh, I'm going to be helping that kid. Because she wants that rabbit, I guess. Damn it, it won't open. Okay, oh, great. Hey, uh... You suck. Looks like some kind of memorial. Candles are sitting around some type of altar. I've got a weird feeling about this door. Oh, can't go in. What a darn shame. Oh, there's the other guy's arm. There's the guy's arm. Ah! <laughs> Ah, oh, can't do it. I guess it's not implemented or something? Oh. That gets me in the lobby. Okay, now! Oh, God. Nope. Oh, what? How did... Oh. The flames. They dance furiously. That was worth a shot. You're fucking dead, so you can't help me. Radio gun batteries. Oh, can't go downstairs. Oh, that's Jesus. The axe is covered in blood and what or somebody twice my size to even carry it. I keep my handgun ready. Yeah. If only I had like a... Shit, I need to get out of here. 
Yep. Where is it? <gasps> Use a big song, bitch. You can't see me! Nope! What? What is she doing? What is she doing? In the box, get in the box! Huh. You saw nothing! I can't see shit! Go away, please! Next time he runs, walks by to my left, I'm gonna go. You fucking idiot. Oh, leave me alone. Oh, this sucks. Go away. Please go away. Leave. I don't know where you are. Ah! Oh, no! Hey! Yeah, you shot me! You can't stop me! I'm gonna hide in the box. You suck. You suck at stop me. Okay, okay. I'm okay, I'm okay! Leave me alone! <laughs> oh god, why? Leave me alone! Okay, go, go, go! Go, 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 go! Oh my god! No, keep going! Keep going, keep going, keep going, 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 go, 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 go. He can't chase after me, right? Oh my god, he can! He can! He can, he can, he can! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. No, hide in here! Hide in the thing! I almost got fucking scared of shitless right now. Come on. Get the hell out of here. Get out! No way! I'm so sick of your shit! Yeah, that's it's the bathroom back there. He can't get out. It's right over there. There he is. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go.
Oh, man. Take that chance. Come on. Come on, you ugly son of a bitch. He's above me. Okay. Shit, 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 oh, no, no, Let me in! Save him, guy! Oh, boy. What's up? She did say... <laughs> God, why? I don't think you're gonna make this one. This is where it seems like it's ground zero for the fire. Hold on. Clues. Helping Anne. something here for me. Oh. Yeah, hi. Hi, Will. 
Have you found my friend? This is it. That's him, Mr. Whitetail. You really need to stop being late. You take him to the tea party for me. I'll meet you down there after. Uh, sure. Take Mr. Whitetail to the basement. Okay. Can I even get to the basement? Oh, yeah, no. Not from this direction. Hi again. Okay. If I can get to the goddamn basement, that'd be great. I'm just gonna have to haul ass. What? <laughs> okay, so I need like a oxygen mask, I guess. Oh. Oh. Hello? Hey, I'm looking for a way out of this place. So, we gonna save him? No. I'm angry. Mostly at himself. I told her that never ends. Tragic for most perspectives. Not tragic enough for mine. Are you talking about that thing in the hall? What can you tell me about him? We used to be close, but that time has long passed. You'll find what you need in his apartment. His door locks, but you can get it from above. Kill the coward. Do it for me and that girl. Oh, oh! Oh, shit. Okay, please. Guess I just need to go. <laughs> One more floor. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Hi darling, please move. I need to go here, thank you. Oh, I don't have a key. Ronnie, I don't care. Mr. Creepy Axe Man is coming for me. I thought he was. Maybe not. Get your breather for a second. Whew. 
This demo is a hell of a lot longer than last time, and really, really sad I can't save. No, that's, yeah, every time. That's maintenance. I gotta get all the way back down. <gasps> Why are you right there? Why are you right there? Double back! Ah! I just need to get past you, get me! <laughs> this game is so fucking scary. <laughs> Susie, run! I don't know how happy you are right now, darling. I'm fucking scared right now. <laughs> I just want to get the fuck out of here. At least she won't come down here. If I get into the maintenance room, there might be a mask or something I could use. Now I can go in the basement and either choose to save the girl. Okay, what do you got for me? Pick up birthday card. Save the notes. Folder that contains various notes and papers. Cool. Okay. Um, I, I, I want that. Oh, ammo. Yeah. That's gonna help. Oh, I was like, wow, I actually made it work. Okay. Shouldn't, but... Oh. When was the last time I even ate something? Am I really getting a snack? Alright. Damn. Looks like I'll have to wait even longer. To the boiler room. Oh, thank God. Hey again, mister. You can call me Will Annie. Oh, okay then, Will. Annie. I thought your name was Will. <laughs> Funny. I really can't tell if you're being serious or not. It's just Will. Well, Will, I have some good news. Oh yeah, what's that? I have something that I think will unlock the door. You can have it too. But I'm not to give it to you until you can prove to me that you deserve it. Kid, I'm not playing games here. If you have what I need, then you need to give it to me. Sorry, mister, I, I'll be punished if I do that. I have an idea. I do some pictures of me with Brendan and his friend. If you bring those to me, then I'll prove that you understand. You'll be punished, hmm? I found something, I think. What do you mean I need to find more? What do you mean I need to find more? Oh no, there's two more drawings. I gotta go back up there where that asshole is. Oh man, I don't want to do that. <sighs> okay. He is upstairs. Hey, can't blame a guy for trying.
<laughs> All right. That's one. That was one drawing. So next draw. I don't know how long this episode's gonna. Be. <gasps> this is not what I thought would happen today. Up, 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 up. Oh, I can't go up. Your door's a secret. A shortcut. Thank you. Hey, how you doing? You're an asshole. I hate you. So does the rock. <laughs> that was worth a shot. Looks like this person was viciously hacked apart. I need to stop looking at this before I get sick. Yeah, let me in the room though. Okay, and I'm like candle sitting on a box. Should I? Okay, oh. Ooh. Oh, okay. It's me as well. did anything. Oh dear! Nah. Oh, sorry, didn't mean to interrupt your uh, alone time. Yeah. <laughs> it's got such a cool design, but I fucking hate you. Scares the ah! Fire scares the beast. Fire slain the dragon. Test the theory. No. That didn't work. Fucking. Tuck, tuck. I don't have any more. Anything I can use. I'm very confused. Hold on. Ronnie, I can't believe it's been 40 years since that blah, 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 January night. <laughs> September, I think he tried to write. You should visit soon. Love you, man. Ow. 
1992. Hey, a year after I was born. Oh, a couple months after I was born. Change roof password to something easy to remember. Tell Garrison new password. And let's use the phone to take a photo. Excellent. Now we gotta wake our way back to the map. Or the roof. Where am I right now? I'm at a, I'm at A1, so I gotta get all the way upstairs. It's gonna suck. No, I didn't need anything here. Now. Yeah. Back. Oh, damn it. And give me the position uh, staging. Okay. Oh, I can just go this way. Take me here. Should be able to. Okay. Eight, nine, nine, one. No. One. Oh. One. Okay, um, zero, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Damn. I'm going by the sheet I took a photo of. Looks like it'd be six, nine, nine, nine. Um, Um, do you, do you mind? Do you mind? So rude. So very, very rude. down to the... I gotta get back down to the maintenance room. Uh, hold on. Zero, I'm going by the photo I might took with my phone. Zero, eight, one, four. Zero, eight, one, one. <sighs> okay, hold on. Birthday card. One, three, five, nine. Let's try that. One, three, five, Gaze <gasps> into the night. 
Looking up beyond the edge of the rooftop, I can see a single set of buildings. Beyond those, nothing. I don't care, I'm fucking out of that place. Oh, pick up. Pick up dirty apartment keys. Okay. I mean, you try every door. Uh, it says see something, so. Oh. <laughs> well, not getting down that way. Well, it, you know. I think I would have thought about that one. Oh, hold on. I need to stretch my leg for a second. Oh, goodness. I don't know how long I've been recording. I needed to stretch my leg. I think I was falling asleep. This is supposed to be a quick video. And now it's become so much more. Or at least, I know it said C on the key. And well, there's only one floor. No. Don't do this to me. I can't. A shortcut of financial happiness. The book is priced at fifty nine ninety nine. Stop. I can't. I can't do the kid crying thing. Oh God. If I can get by all blood, it looks like I could work my way down the hole and through them. I'm gonna be careful. Oh, hi. Another body. This one is different, though. Sadness, anger, death. This place reeks of human emotion. Much like the wreath that wanders the oh. hall. Might be worth trying to figure out what happened here. This is my weapon now. I feel slightly more protected. Body appears to have entry wounds around the neck. Possibly self-inflicted. So... This dude killed himself in his... But he's not wearing boots or gloves to his uniform. Oh, I should have died beside them. Now oh, I wish I had. Well. Okay. Friend got a little bit mad. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, God, why? Do you understand, Will? This man's lost his humanity and now wanders aimlessly the hall. I exploit his death. You know, this man, I... I can't afford to feel for the dead. I should do whatever it is I need to escape this place. What else is out here? Fireman clothes were stained blood on them. I wonder if I can get to... How many drawings do I have? One, two, and four. So I need to find drawing three. Okay. Where's damage? Just can't get in. Where's that one with the broken tool, like the thing blocking the way?
Meh. You did nothing for me, Dodeca, eat your trapezoid. Whew, this is going much longer than I thought it would. I don't know how long I've been recording for. I think it was on the second floor. Yeah, it's on the second floor. So I guess I'll use the piece of glass. I'm assuming I'll use the piece of glass. If not, I'm going to probably just go and... Where's that fireman guy? I think I'll just end it there. Cause I mean, the thing is, this is the demo, so it's not like this is gonna watch this game's the demo. Oh, oh hey, I was opening the door. Rude. Oh God, why? And faster, William. Faster. Oh. Okay. No, I need the I need the gas mask. Shit. Sorry, Mr. Teddy Bear. Oh. Where did I need this? Oh god, that scared me. Yeah, everything going black scared the living shit out of me. I'm not even joking. I don't think it's much of a hiding place. And yeah, no, it's not. She's just like in her bathtub or something? Like, what the fuck happened? I'm sorry, Mr. Teddy Bear. Oh, shit. Oh, now I gotta watch this again. Ah! Okay, well. I'm fucking confused. <sighs> Do you have the drawings yet? Are these your drawings? Yeah, yeah. All but one of them. Where's the last drawing, woman? Point of this boiler room if I can't do anything in it. <sighs> okay. Okay. I can't possibly on the lobby, can it? I shouldn't laugh. Okay, 
So it's not on A. At least on in C. Oh, this is really frustrating me. Something in the keyhole, but I can't open it. Frustrating, honestly. Like, -na 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 -na. oh god, damn it! I don't. What? It doesn't work every time, does it? Okay, 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 okay. I've got the gas mask. I got a gun. I got a piece of glass, but that's not really gonna do much for me. Back in here. Oh god, darling, please. Shit. That's not what I wanted to do. Ah, God, if I do that one more time. Okay, Steve, maybe you can help me out. Nope. Sorry. I thought you would actually tell me. Oh. Come on. Very confused as to where I need to go. The like, logical place would tell me this. I don't care, let me open it. Ugh. One bullet left. This is gonna go fantabulously. All right, let's look over the notes. I have failed at this life. One simply, one simple fucking job to save those who need it most. Since that summer day, I have witnessed away and did nothing but I have withered away to nothing. But I failed little Anne Marie. Poor girl burns to death trying to save her stuffed animal. Ah. It's actually really sad. And never go to that. Eligible after all. Hmm. Oh, I'm dumb. I gotta go. Do I go here? Oh, stop, please. 
I can take the baby crying. I can't. I can't. It always in games. It always just gets to me. Okay, I guess I gotta find him now. Like I gotta purposely seek him out. I mean, I don't want to seek him out. You're around here somewhere. Come on. Yes, here we go. Okay. Whew. I did it. Finally. The void takes the frail and braves the tenacious. This is the glass shard that I used to destroy the fireman with. It's been covered in his blood. Looks like the person was viciously hacked up. Okay. And, uh, hi, sweetie! Hey! I'm sorry. I had no choice. I really didn't want to do it. Uh, hey, Marie, I'm sorry. Oh, God, I feel like such an asshole. Well, now I don't have him to worry about. Okay, wait, when was that always there? Those are shoes, okay. She burned to death. Now I need to find that room. It was on the B floor. I need to go to that floor. Maybe the maybe now I can use it like a fucking blood weapon. I'm just gonna try to go to the lobby. Maybe that's what I need to do. I really do feel terrible about killing the firemen, but... God, this game's gonna mess with me when it comes out, ain't it? Oh. Oh, I had no choice. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I probably could have helped the little girl. I probably could have helped Anne Marie. God, what is with games and little girls just like. I'm either betraying them or they're going to kill me. Jesus. Looks like he was crucified on the wall. Can't say I feel good about what I had to do. But I'll do whatever it takes. Time to move forward. I mean, I don't... I didn't do this. I... Oh, boy. This game's gonna be rough, ain't it? Like, this is just the demo. I can't wait to see how I'm gonna just be just...
a note. Will. Walt's note. Will, do you remember what it was like crying over the loss of a loved one? The absolute pain and despair that sealed into your flesh after that night has left scars for the world to see. Trust me when I say that in the end. You can learn to reconcile with this pain. However, you must accept that your actions here have consequences. What you have done worries me. To be honest, I couldn't care less what happens to all the other souls locked up in this place. All I truly care about is you, and all I want for you to come out at the end of the man I know you want to be. You must not let the search for answers cause you to lose sight of who you are. Sometimes you must just wish for all of this to end. It saddens me to have to tell you that this is only the beginning of your anguish. However, there is light at the end of the tunnel. You just have to keep yourself from getting lost in the darkness. Yours truly, Walt. Am I sure I want to enter this door? No. Oh. Fresh air. This is nice. Eh, yeah, something tells me it ain't. Tracks. I should see where this takes me. I'm starting to think this isn't a... This is, a, first off, a long-ass demo. What the... What the hell was that? Oh... Thanks for playing. Yes, I enjoyed my experience. Ooh. I don't... Fuck, that was good. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the Immure demo, and that was, a, first off, one of the longest demos I ever played, and some of the most fun I had playing a demo. But like I said, this is not the demo I played at uh, too many games. This is almost a full game, just that experience alone. That's like one of those quick games, but in the good way. So as you can see up here, their Kickstarter launches October 15th. Please, please, please donate to Muir. Uh, this is not sponsored. I absolutely love this game. I love the idea. I love the art. I like the feeling of I was actually afraid playing this game. So please help fund this game as I will be soon enough. I, I can't wait. Um, shout out to the developers for all the work, and I, I did meet them and I had a nice little chat with them uh, at Too Many Games. And needless to say, I can't wait for the full release. I can't wait to get my hands on more of this. And if an art book happens to come out, or if uh, Muir needs a voice actor for Will, uh, I might be uh, free for that. But hey, as always, thank you guys so much for tuning in to this much longer episode than normal, and much longer demo than I'm used to, but... Thank you guys so much for uh, watching. If you have a game you'd like me to play, hit me up on Twitter at CFISJamesM. Free is good, but I will gladly pay. Uh, I will be looking forward to Muir coming out. I've got a couple other games lined up to my queue. God, I can't fucking wait for this. So, until next time, take care, folks.